and we have this next question which says the following SAS program is submitted so here we have a data step with some data lines in it and then we have a procedure which is proc freak and then we have another procedure which is proc print so we have some input variables patient number aesoc aept and on treat and there are few rows in it and then let us try to analyze what this proc freak is doing proc freak data is equal to work dot ae no print where on treat is equal to y tables aesoc out is equal to freak one so this syntax is suppressing the output in output window and then creating an output data set called freak one in work library by fetching the one-way frequencies for AESOC variable and then if we take a look at the where statement only those rows which have a value of y in on treat are being considered for this one-way table and then we have this proc print step which says proc free proc print data is equal to frequent no obs where aesoc is equal to cardiac disorders var count so out of the uh, data set produced from proc freak we are printing the row which has aesoc is equal to cardiac disorders and printing the value from count variable in that data set so let us take a look at the actual question it says what result is displayed for the variable count when we execute this complete program so in order to answer this question we need to take the bottom up approach so we need to see what is being happening in the last step and then see the dependency of it in the prior step and then take a look at the actual data so here we are printing the value from count variable for cardiac disorders in aesoc so out of multiple rows from proc freak we are only subsetting the row which has the value of cardiac disorders in aesoc and then if we take a look at the proc freak procedure it is doing a one-way tabulation for aesoc by default proc freak counts the number of records with a value in the specified variable and reports that number of observations in a variable called count so here here we are interested in cardiac disorders only so then in this table statement aesoc we need to check how many number of rows would be reported in freak one in first place so let us see how many number of rows are there in input data set with aesoc is equal to cardiac disorders so we have cardiac disorders in the first instance and then so we have the second instance for 2004 and then another instance for the same subject 2004 which is total count has become 3 now and then 2010 there is another cardiac disorder so we have four rows with a value of cardiac disorders in aesoc variable but if we take a look at this so only those rows which have been uh, having a value of y on on treat variable are being used as input for proc freak so out of these four rows some would be eliminated based if they meet this if they do not meet this condition so if we see here on the first row we have a value of y so this would be considered on the second row again we have a value of y so this would also be considered on the third row of cardiac disorders we have a value of n in on treat so this would not be counted so we only have two overall pi now and then on the fourth instance of cardiac disorders we have a value of y out of the four cardiac disorders only three has a value of y in on treat so effectively the output data set from proc freak would only have a value of three on cardiac disorders row so the expected answer is three and then let's see if this is actually the case yes so our response was three and the correct response was also three so this is how we need to approach solving this problem